Hello guys, welcome to Hearsay on Sin One TV. In today's JC One production in conjunction with YouTube premiered a new sitcom called Aye Toro, which is a spin-off of Jennifer's Diary. It was an amazing night story with lots of celebs like Ketancho, Femi Branch, Funsho Adeolo, Iniedo, Shafi Bello, Toke Makinwa, Lala Akindoju, Jide Wabono, Lolo, Choma Chukuka, Inkechi Blessing, Runke Oshudi, Omoni Oboli, Adunia Ade, Martins Fields, Judith Christopher, Ogbolo, Yapa Ojo, Worry Picking, and a host of other celebrities. Destiny Boy loses his Instagram account and this boy is in serious tears so guys let's help him get back his Instagram account so he stops crying. Alright another quick update so Solid Star the Omo Tenna Kruna has given us a new cut a new look for probably a new single that we're waiting for and I'm sure you guys remember he just released a new one called Nyarinya. So guys Dubai businessman and billionaire I should call him Mofa just recently acquired himself a brand new whip worth millions of naira. I'm talking hundreds of millions of naira. All right, with well his caption here, he says, Bought myself a flying bird, McLaren for my birthday gift. Ex Big Brother housemate Uti Mwachuku, he went to Instagram to shower praises on her, calling her the most successful housemate of BBN 2018. Now, some other housemates have like mixed reaction to this, but some have come out to talk, while some are just staying in their shell to just you know observe. Now, someone like Princess went to her Instagram to make a post, and she said, "I felt as a former housemate, he should know better than outrightly quoting a comparison. It is just unnecessary. Most of the housemates have gone through a phase of the." depression, insecurity, anger and regret and they have also moved past it and gotten stronger. You can't come and start this unspoken trivia now, it is not cool. Anyway, I kind of support Princess with this one because it doesn't somehow make sense. We all strive to make ourselves better. Alright, that's it for Gist Update on Hearsay.